This is Rex from 16 Drones. I'm the guitarist and keyboardist of the band. And this video is gonna be about recording, our recording process. And I know that we did a video, like I think about four years ago, back 2008. So like a little over four years ago. And that was when we did have all those gears that we have now uh, but over the over the past how many years I've invested and bought all this uh, gear that we, all this equipment that we use for recording these days starting in 2008 because we started recording in 2007 and we had some really cheap ass equipment back then so yeah Alright, uh, first of all, this is what we mainly use to record guitars and bass. Um, this is the Line 6 Pod X3 Live. Uh, this is pretty old. Um, it's like, I don't know how, how many years old this is, but I was able to obtain this back in 2008, late 2008. That's when we started recording like better sounding stuff. Because uh, back then we used to just run it through a Digitech RP50, uh, plugged in directly to the computer, and it's like I don't know. Um, what the quality wasn't as good. It wasn't as good like if you watched our previous video on how we record stuff yeah that, that one the old video that we did was for people who are very low on budget oh and and for some people who would so yeah some people who actually tell me I should upgrade to line 6 pod HD 500 or something like that I've actually uh, played with that before but I, I, I prefer using the X3 Live because it has it's more to my um, preference uh, I feel that this is better for me than the HD 500 and you don't have to agree with that but that's just my opinion okay this is the Line 6 Pod X3 Live and the way we record is I plug in my guitar and this is one of the only guitars I own. This is a choir strat. Um, complete with the uh, hot rod noise just pick up, standard pick up. This is a, a jet back signature. Jet back is one of my favorite guitars. And then, uh, for, as for our recording program I, I use three different recording programs one of them is the Sony Acid Pro 6 and the other two are Adobe Audition and yeah sorry that's my text of my phone right and then the other one we use is we actually do use Audacity sometimes but that's more like for quick recording and then later we transfer them to uh, Sony as a code for everything. Okay, one of the recording uh, here that we use is the Dexicon Alpha. It's a very cheap actually, uh, but I, I like using it. I know it's like an old. Uh, it's a old, it's an old gear um, that they used like maybe for that came out like maybe three years ago, and 
very useful. I use, we use this to record vocals. We used to record vocals uh, with the Line 6 HD line, but uh, these days this is what we use for uh, recording using mics. And then we also, actually we run this from Mixer, so we can run like multiple mics, multiple mics, and that's what we use to record live drums. Uh, my drum set right now is at our practice space, and sometimes we record it. The drums there. Sometimes we record the drums with the Yamaha ZD55. Uh, we run that uh, through USB in the computer, and uh, we use the VST, uh, VSTs such as uh, the well, some drum VSTs. I'm pretty sure you're hearing some of that in the recording. And for our other stuff. We record it through my keyboard. Well, you can't see it right now, it's, it's over here. Uh, we run that through, uh, through USB also, and we use some VSTs. Um, and there, there's like a lot of really good VSTs out there that we use. Yeah, so pretty much that's uh, what we do, what we use for recording uh, for those people who actually message. Uh, our message, uh, send me a message through YouTube and well, through the band's YouTube channel and actual, actually my uh, my own personal YouTube channel where I record covers. Yeah. So that's that. Don't look back as you pass it by. There's more to life